got it? It's like not good. It looks great. Hello and welcome back to Podcast But Outside. This episode 40. This is the intro. That's a lot of episodes. Wow, we should quit. It's a great episode. We have a really weird interview with a strange guest that I'm still not quite over. Mm -hmm. And then we also have a really long interview with our friend Andrew Sawicki. Mm -hmm. Who's he, Andrew? He's pretty much a documentarian of the YouTube world. He makes the most popular videos on YouTube, him and his collaborator Shane Dawson. They make these really fascinating in-depth documentaries about popular youtubers yeah jake paul yeah uh jeffrey star was just, the most recent one yeah check out his stuff if you haven't although i'm sure you have because they're the most popular videos in the world uh we have a live show coming up on monday january 20th in los angeles that's next monday tickets are truly almost sold out and it's going to be a great show what do we have in store cole oh well, we got some uh customized merch that we're going to be selling we got this mug right here just one mug and one, one pin one pin wait where'd it go where'd, it fell off oh Where'd it go? Oh, it's inside. Oh. As it, as it shouldn't be. It should be outside. We got a pin right there. We have one mug and one pin, so come and buy those. We also have follow-up interviews with past guests that we've met on the street. We're keeping those secret, but they are some of our favorite guests of all time. And we have some friends of ours, too. Who's that? Gabe Gundacker. Chris Fleming. Wow. It'll be a really fun show. We hope to see you there. Please buy your tickets now. There will be no tickets available on the day of. It's looking like it will be sold out. Mm -hmm. Music this week is by... Jaden Schultz, a.k.a. In Pajamas. It's a great song for a great guy on a great day. Well, you don't know if this day's good. Blessed be our lives, holy art thyself. Okay. May the Lord open. Enjoy your episode. It is your episode now. It's yours, no take backs. Goodbye. Bye. Cue the intro. I've got a podcast, but it's outside. I've got a podcast, but it's outside. I've got a podcast outside. Hello, and welcome back to Podcast But Outside. Wait, did you have these headphones on before? Why? What do you mean? You were wearing these. For a second? What are you talking about? You have an ear infection. I don't want to catch it. It's not like that. <laughs> that is not how ear infections work. <laughs> you really think they're contagious? Are you... Am I going to get... Is my <laughs> ear going to get all jacked up? No. <laughs> Well, you're, you've been complaining all week. I just don't want to get an ear infection. Welcome to Podcast Foot Outside. My name is Andrew Michon. My name is Cole. And the point... Hurt. Of, Sorry. The point of the show is Cole and I set up a table on the sidewalk, and we are willing to talk to anyone who walks by. Um, For we have that a, service, we pay, that a do, uh, we pay them a dollar. We have a sign on our table that says, Hi, please be a guest on our podcast. We will pay you one dollar. Smiley, smiley face. face. Got a smiley face at the end of the sign. We're in Glendale, California. We're across from the Americana Mall. And I've never felt more American than I do today. I've never felt more Glendale. It's raining. It's currently raining on us. So a little drippy drop. It's been raining basically for five days straight, and we needed to record an episode. And so it said that it was going to stop raining around two today. So we ended up starting to record, which is now, and you guys are here. And um, hey guys, hey guys, want to yeah. make a dollar? No, they don't want to. Sometimes people look like fucking idiots, and I don't want them on our show. Well. I think you're just upset that they said no. Yes, I am. Oh. I'm brutally upset. Okay. I do have an ear infection. It is not contagious. Well, <laughs> so for those I'll of you, be the judge of that. So for those of you listening and you're afraid that my ear infection will come through the podcast and go into your ears, it's not going to happen like that. It does not work like that. Although I did get the ear infection li from listening to a podcast. <laughs> Which one? Um, oh, my God. She's the bride. Whoa. She's the bride. Oh, Oh, uh, there was a bride. Hello. Are you going to the wedding? No. no. Okay. You're coming here? <laughs> Those are your options. Someone's getting married right next to us. What oh is this? My Something gosh. palace? What wedding is that? palace. <gasps> wedding palace. Wow. What do you think the chances are we could interview another bride? I'd say one out of two chance. 50% chance. Well, her no, dress, one out of two is what I call it. Her dress was kind of huge. It was like really flowing and all over, cascading on the street. It's wet and muddy. 
it is raining out here. Our equipment is getting a little wet. This has happened once before, I think, and I think it's all for the best. Just in case. Um, so how's life, Cole? It's good. I, uh, well, this will probably come up way later. Yeah, it's okay. I got, ho- I got back from Ohio. Also known as Ohio. Uh-huh. I, mean, you know I was there for Thanksgiving. I was there for a week. It's good? Uh, yeah. I didn't leave the house. Whose house? My parents. Oh. Were they, did they think it was weird that you were there for so long? Uh, yes. Huh. They didn't know I was there, actually. Oh, so you were kind of hiding? Yeah. That's cool. Hey, you want to make a dollar? No worries. Uh, you got to yeah. go, go, go make a deal. Yeah, he's got a suit on. You think that guy needs a dollar? I just was in Costa Rica for nine days, speaking of places that I went. And? It was great. Fun yeah. country. I didn't leave the house. What? Yeah, just like you. What house? Your house. <laughs> <laughs> I call your house in Ohio, Costa Rica, and <laughs> I was hiding there, too. We were both hiding. You were hiding oh. from your parents. I was hiding from you. Oh, okay. Yeah, I did not see you once. Uh-huh. No, it was in Costa Rica, the country. It's in Central America. It was my first time there. My first time south of Mexico, and it was great. A really nice uh, place. Everyone was very kind. The weather... The weather was good. The nature was unparalleled. The wildlife was impressive. And the vibes were chill. Good country. You you ziplined, yes? I ziplined. I surfed. I saw sloths in trees. Were you scared at all? Of which part? The sloths? No, they were friendly. What about the ziplining? That was terrifying. Oh, well, this sounds like a nice vacation. It was very tropical there. Um, It's a great country if you ever have a chance to go take that chance and run with it oh. yeah it's cool though it's a it is um maybe i'll go right now well wait till we finish the episode oh uh, right it's a good country everyone's really it's an easy place to travel i've traveled a lot around the world and costa rica was definitely a highlight hey you guys want to make a dollar hey how's it going no worries make a dollar i like your glasses are there frames in those oh he's not yeah wait come here i want to see those <laughs> did you ask are there frames in those did you mean lenses <laughs> Just asking. <laughs> no, he just had floating uh, oh, lenses. glass. Oh, lenses so you were asking if there are frames eyes. in was, those? Yeah. But wouldn't it be outside of those? That's what I meant, outside of them. So you did misspeak. Yeah, well, he had glass hovering in front of his eyes. Oh, so I you was, were I was obviously little, I was twisted. jarred. I was twisted. You were definitely twisted. I was all, my whole world was turned upside down. for Topsy-turvy. Topsy-turvy coal. Hey, you guys want to make a dollar? Okay. Yeah, you do. No worries. Okay. Maybe... What? I don't know. I hear, I sense a criticism coming. That couple sucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying, if you don't, if you're well, not they like were interracial. Does that have anything to do with it? No, actually, I, oh. I, I, um, I take it back. I, there was, that couple is goals. <laughs> that couple is hardcore goals. Uh, too many. Too, too many, many people. Hey, guys. Too big of a family. What's up? It's okay. What's okay? Uh, she gave her husband a look like, is this the world we want to raise our children in? And I said, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. They'll be okay. They're podcasting on the street now. I don't want little Jeremiah to grow up in this hellscape. That's a, my impression of that woman. Hey, you want to make a dollar? Hey, talk oh, to us. Smiley. You guys want to make a dollar? You want to talk to us? No worries. I like your frames. Glasses. <laughs> Are there lenses in there? <laughs> I don't want Jeremiah to grow up in a world where two guys can be on the street recording a podcast and people like us won't even sit down. You're still on that? It's the only funny thing that's happened so far. (laughs) (laughs) So, yeah, I'm definitely riding that one to the grave. (laughs) Come have a seat. Yeah, let's go talk to us for a minute. You know, we're just talking about whatever. Talking about whatever. It's a little podcast. Here, how about you? Hey, how's it going? Hey, Luis. Luis. Oh, how you doing, man? You want to sit down in this chair? Yeah. Either of you? We got room for two. We got room for two. Good Dodgers. You could stand over here if you'd like. All right, come have a seat. Pop this on. Pop this on. So, Luis, you said. Yes, sir. What's your name? Can you say that into the microphone? Just say, name's Luis, just so we got it. Hi, my name is Luis. All right, what about you? What's your name? Hi, my name is Saeed. Saeed. Okay. What's your name? Samir. Samir. Hey, uh, how you guys doing today? Good. Uh, good. And you guys? Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, yeah. What are um, you guys getting up to? 
Uh, not much, just walking around at the mall, hanging okay. out, enjoying the you know beautiful weather. Yeah, that's it was here. a little bit yeah, rainy, but now it's nice. Yeah, it was yeah. pretty bad. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, have you guys ever been ghosted before? What do you mean by ghosted? Like someone just kind of like you make plans or something, and someone abandons you, or like someone doesn't show up, like uh, they kind of stand you up. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I've, I have been ghosted a couple oh, yeah? times before. Mm-hmm. Yeah. By yeah, to be honest. like by romantic interests or just friends. Um. Never romantic interest, but usually friends. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's annoying, huh? It's kind of disrespectful. Yeah. 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 I agree with you on that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So. Interesting. All right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, wait. So you guys are doing what around here? Walking. Around. You can walk yeah, by. Walk you can walk by. Uh, yeah. Okay. Just walking around. Walk around the okay. mall. Yeah, you got a lot of Dodgers gear on, huh? Dodger yeah. boys. Uh huh. Hometown boys. Excited for your team. Yes, sir. Cool. Yeah. How they doing right now? Uh. Well, we're off season. Oh, right now. cool. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. Are you guys in middle school? High school? Oh, yeah, um, yeah. Uh, high school? We're both high schoolers, middle schooler. Okay, okay cool. Yeah. What part of LA you, you live in? Uh, we're uh, three of us. We're originally from uh, Inglewood. Okay. But we moved up here to Glendale. Oh, do you like okay. Glendale? Uh, yeah, it's alright. I mean, I like the weather. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. the weather's different than Inglewood? Is it? I mean, I, I, I wouldn't say it's different. I feel like it's the same, but. Um, you just like LA? Yeah, I, I just love LA. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. So, what's it like to grow up in LA? We, we both lived here for. I've lived here for like six or seven years. He's lived okay. here for a few, but I, ne- I didn't grow up here. What's it like? Uh, I, I don't really know sure, how to sure, put sure, it together. Sure. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, let's see. You're, you're you know you're young. You're walking around the mall, seeing mm-hmm. lots of interesting people. I grew mm-hmm. up in a small town in Colorado. I didn't have as much access to culture and stuff. Oh, okay. I think. Well, that's yeah. I mean, uh, I, I do know people that you know have grown up on the countryside mm-hmm. and they don't really have any of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, I I mean I've been to uh, I've been to uh, Iowa before the state of Iowa. Mm-hmm. Um, I've been to the countryside. And yeah. then just being there, it's uh, you kind of get that feeling that, you know, I miss L.A., you know, because it's so <laughs> different. Like, yeah. you don't have the mall or anything around over there. And if you do have a mall, it's uh, it's some driving distance away. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. All right. Mm. And what about you? You like you like living in L.A.? Uh, yeah, it's pretty good here. Yeah. 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 What do you guys like to do for fun? Uh, for fun? Uh, I mean, uh, you can walk by. You know, please, 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 please. Uh, no worries. For fun, we just hang around with friends, you know, see what's going on. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Nice. Okay. Mm-hmm. Got any questions? Oh, you cool. go ahead. You're fine. Um, yeah. So what? Uh, what's are a lot of people dating in school and stuff? <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's uh, it's a high school, middle school thing. A lot of people are dating. Yeah. So, are yeah. you dating anyone? Yeah, I, I have a girlfriend. Oh, oh really? Nice. Yeah. How long have you guys been dating? Uh, since I'm a junior now, so since freshman year. Okay, wow, long yeah. term, huh? Long time. Wow, okay. What do you What do you guys like about each other? Uh, I mean, she's uh, she's not really like you know, uh, she doesn't like to judge okay. a lot. So like that judgy side kind of thing. So yeah. Okay. So that's good. Non-judgmental. Yeah, non-judgmental. What about you? you got any love in your life? Uh, no. Okay. You interested in anyone? Um. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> What's going on with that? Um. I've been trying. Oh, for oh, one okay. specific girl? Yeah. Ooh, Ooh, what's the progress? Um, Pretty bad because it's his girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no. No. Um, I'm almost there. You're almost, almost there? there. How, do okay. you, how do you know that? Um, I already know <laughs> by Ooh. her, so yeah. Oh, okay. Ooh. So, like, it's a situation where, like, are you talking to her friends and they've said that she's interested right, in you? Right. Yeah, basically. Okay. Yeah. So, what's the next step, huh? I don't really know. Are no. you scared? Um, not really, no. Oh, you're ready, huh? Is there a school dance or something coming up? No. No? Do you okay. like the girl he's interested in? Is she cool? I mean, I've, I've seen her. She looks like she's pretty cool, like a yeah. pretty nice person. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. How I about like you? you? Any 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 love in your life? Any love? Not yet. Not yet. All right. It's coming, okay. though. It's coming, yeah, it's my friend. it's coming for him. Yes, yeah, sir. I like that. Come up. So, you're younger than them? or? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm okay. the youngest. You're in middle school? Yeah. But how are you guys all? Fr- how'd you guys all become friends? Oh, we're we're related actually. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, all yeah. you? Yeah. Oh, really? But in what way? Um, our dad's from uh, Bangladesh. It's a country uh, yeah, south yeah. of India, yeah, and yeah. then our mom's Salvadorian, a country south of Mexico. Ooh. Yeah. Wait, you're all brothers? All yeah. brothers. Oh, brothers. really? Oh, that's okay. kind of cool. Yes, sir. Oh man, that's amazing. Yeah. yeah. Some people don't actually believe us when we tell them that they're like, "Nah, you guys are friends." You kind of oh, look different. Yeah. You, yeah. Look, you, you, look you all look different. similar but different. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. it's kind of yeah. interesting. I like that. Oh wow. Yeah. Thank uh, you. Cool. That's cool. Yeah. Wow. So you are your parents still together? And yeah, yeah. yeah oh, that's cool. They all live in Glendale. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Is there a lot of Bangladeshi food at your house and stuff? Yeah, there is. Oh yeah, what's yeah, Bangladeshi food like? Um, it, it's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just uh, too spicy. No, oh, I, I can't handle it at times. Oh really? Yeah. 
Are you the spice. weakest as far as in the family for yes, spice? Yes, sir. I mean, they take it like nothing. I, oh, really? I can't, yeah. I can't handle. I can't handle that at all. You can't all. handle the spice? No, sir. Oh man. Oh. Cool. Well, that's cool, brothers, yeah. huh? So you're the oldest, and then middle, and then Oldest? youngest. Yes, sir. Are there sisters or? No, no. Just sisters. three boys, huh? Yeah. Three boys. Is three that boys. a rough? Is that rough on your family, on your parents, or what? Three crazy yeah, boys. Yeah, they, w- they wanted a girl at first. I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everyone wants a mix, but you know what? Yeah. Three, yeah. three cool boys. You can't complain. Yeah. <laughs> cool. uh, do you guys fight ever a lot at all? <laughs> ever a lot at all. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's mostly about the smallest stuff that we fight for. Oh, okay, mm, like, like girls. <laughs> I mean, not not really girls, but more like um, materialistic things. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. So, like, if he's wearing my sweater, mm. I'll, I'll punk on him for that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Or if I'm wearing one of his T-shirts, he'll punk on me for that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Basic stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Basic. That's cool. Oh. You guys play oh. video games and stuff? Yeah. Uh, yeah, we, sometimes. There's not, you know what there's not enough of these days? There's not enough video games you can play together in a room. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because when I grew up, there were more video games that were like local multiplayer. Yeah, yeah, and now yeah. it's all online. Mm-hmm. So I feel like if you guys even want to play together, you have to each get your own system, you know? Yeah. It's I mean. W- is it like we, that? Yeah. In the house, there's It's kind of annoying, PS4s, you know? Yeah, I feel like they should have more games that encourage sitting with your friends and playing yeah. video games together, mm-hmm. you know? I agree. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Let's get that going. Yeah. Yeah. I'll start that ASAP. All right. You guys have any other final thoughts or advice you want to give to the listeners or um, any, any thoughts? I'm just going to wave at the camera. Oh, I like that. That's it. (laughs) Well, you guys are awesome guests. We really appreciate you sitting down to talk to us. Thank you, sir. Um, We're going to pay you each a dollar and give you a sticker. There's a sticker for you, a sticker for you, and a sticker for you. Here's a dollar for you. you. And then we just have this new, like, dollar machine that uh, a listener made us. Okay. There's a dollar for you. There's a dollar for you with some tape on it. Appreciate it. And there's a dollar for you. With no tape on it. There's no tape on it. All right. See you guys. Thank have a great you. day. Thank you guys. Have a good day. We appreciate it, man. You guys were great guests. Thank you. Enjoy the day. You too. Yeah. Be yeah. well. Thanks for sitting down. They were awesome. Man, this is beautiful. The weather is getting nice. It was so, so rainy earlier. Ooh. We have this little box, and it was made by a fan, and we think his name is Mike or Michael, but it might be a different name, and we'll think him in the outro. We can't look it up right now. But he made us a little cardboard box, and it has money that goes in there. And it's so nice of him to make it. Yes. Yeah. Here we are in Glendale. Oh, here's our pal right here. Oh, my God. Did he bring coffee? We have a friend of ours who's coming by on purpose, and here he is. You brought coffee. Wow. Andrew. This is so nice. And creamer. Come sit down. Oh, you put a sticker on the creamer. (laughs) Look at this. (laughs) You put a sticker on the creamer. Andrew so Shawicki, everybody. This is so sweet. What? Wow. Oh this my is so gosh. cool. No, no, this is perfect timing, perfect. actually, to be honest. We've talked to five kids so far. You're the first adult. I, he, yeah, you won't, you won't get an ear infection. Don't worry. Don't worry. I was going to go left and right. Oh, okay. I don't think it really matters. We don't, we don't differentiate here. Is Mike on? Is that good? This is, this is crazy. Yeah, you can hear us, huh? Well, nice to meet you, man. Yeah, nice to yeah. meet you in person. Yeah, Andrew, well, yeah, Andrew to Andrew the right true, here. The two Andrews clash. This wow. is cool. We got Andrew Sawicki right here. Well, thank you for the coffee. This is like overload 101. Hey. Just being out here? Just in the seat. Yeah. People everywhere. Oh, yeah. It's, <laughs> it's a bit it, overstimulating. It's an overstimulating experience. I love that you had the, the camera operator. I thought, yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah. I thought that, that wasn't happening. What do you mean? Why? I, thought you, I thought you didn't have a camera person anymore. What? Oh, no. Well, how do you think we're filming it? I yeah. tripod. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Nah. The thing is, because sometimes we have them like kind of move around and look at different things and you got to have a camera. Well, right? so There's a camera. So what's <laughs> it? You're <laughs> not waving to the camera. I'm waving to your camera. No, no, no. no. <laughs> there, no she doesn't exist. Look at the camera. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Intern's out of town. So we have someone else helping out. Yeah. Um, so can you edit this episode for us? <laughs> Please. Yeah. We how, need yeah. you. How long? How, uh, like how much footage do you guys usually have? 30 <laughs> hours. And we, cut yeah. it, we cut it we down, cut down, down to one. one hour. <laughs> <laughs> you just do all night live stream. Yeah. Yeah. No, uh, we, we don't But that's really kind of your job, much. huh? You do actually record for like weeks at a time and then just yeah. release like an hour. I think You're, also, th- let th- me, give th- me th- notes on the mic feedback because I don't know. Like, I don't, I never. There's no, I don't think there's any mic feedback. No, you're looking good. Andrew Sawicki is Shane Dawson's cameraman. If you're watching this on YouTube. And collaborator, and editor, and everything. Yeah. Um, Does it all. If you're watching this on YouTube, you probably already <laughs> know who he is. I wonder if there'll be any videos. They're the kings of YouTube. Any Shane videos connected to this video on the side. Ooh, oh. Recommended. Recommended. Ooh, we'll recommend yeah. some stuff. Algorithmic. Probably some Jeffree Star stuff. Or sure. Andrew. So, two Andrews, one show, huh? 
I love it. Too that's, much. I wrote pretty. A2 on my cup. Oh, oh. Okay. I got to say, I don't drink coffee, but I will use it to <laughs> <Wait>. warm my <laughs> hand. Wait, so and I appreciate and it. So, so Wiki, he brought these are coffee. Venti's. These are Venti. What's it? It's just ice or coffee? Yeah, it's just the extra large. I, I, <laughs> I say extra large coffee. That is so sweet of <laughs> I've you. I've never Andrew. played their game, and not that I think I'm too good for it. It's just it's you never. I'm never going to commit it to memory, so I'm just going to okay. right. right. stick right. with what right. I know. I do. I super appreciate it. And they know what you it. mean when you say extra large. You know what's funny though? I don't feel weird sitting here talking. <laughs> I'd be like. <laughs> There'd be like a twenty-minute like learning period of uh, no, having man. to get over no. the fact that we're just talking no. in the middle of the sidewalk. No, it, it's actually pretty, and and it's funny because you work in entertainment and you make videos. I mean, we talk to people who have nothing to do with what we do, and they are very comfortably sit down and just kind of get into it. I guess it is just like sitting on a bench. People settle right. into it, you know, and, and more than you would think. You just happen to have a microphone. Yeah, just yeah. more exploity. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry, I cut you off from your. You were saying something. Oh, I don't know what I was saying. You're talking about the coffee. Thanks for bringing the oh, coffee. That was so coffee. sweet of you. You brought an entire nice. thing of creamer. Well, the thing is, I wanted to bring you guys coffee because I was bringing coffee, obviously, and then I usually add creamer to mine, but. Yeah. I actually emailed those people to try to get them to like sponsor me, and they didn't do it. So, uh -oh. oh, you Coffee put uh, <laughs> you put our sticker <laughs> over it. Podcast about that. Mm. I like that. I can send you the rejection email <laughs> if you want to put it on screen. Oh yeah. In I general, like yeah. for for your YouTube work, you I ask like them. Oh, they, they I actually never, responded. I never ask anybody for like you know sure. inquiry stuff, but I was like, this is the perfect thing for me <laughs> because really? I use it every single time I edit and I'm like oh that'd be so organic I could yeah, show yeah. myself pouring the creamer and like time to edit Instagram <laughs> store and then just just the corporate rejection wow just it was on some like wow they weren't even trying to see the vision at all right. wow. which I kind of get it because I got to keep it moving but uh -huh. also it's like maybe, well, they're like maybe they're just like look we're doing good I'm just trying to set we're the, selling our stuff <laughs> I'm just trying to set the president now so yeah, right. not gonna be, yeah I like yeah. that I like that it works um, so are you you buy the coffee and Starbucks coffee in bulk <laughs> at the store, right? Yeah. That's your thing. Wait, really? What do you mean? Like at the grocery store, they have like, what is it? Liters? Me medium roast. Medium I think it's roast. a liter. Yeah. And that's what you buy? Green. And you Green. heat it up at home? Green. <laughs> no. <it's laughs> I mean, this should not be funny. <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no, this not should not be. <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I just, I've never thought about doing that. And that kind of makes it. Oh, it you, oh, you eat at room temperature? It no, drink? it's iced coffee. Sorry. Oh, you do ice. It's, oh. it's in the fridge. I the get it. Refrigerated. Now. I see why you're laughing at I'm, me. No, no, no. <laughs> the laughter wasn't about the idea of doing it. The laughter was I never connected the fact that that's a possibility. Oh, sure, sure. So I'm almost sure. like making fun of myself <laughs> yeah. for overlooking that. You're like, I love hot coffee, but this one's cold. Oh. So I guess it'll just be I should cold. get a coffee maker, though, because you know, yeah, sometimes man. I don't I'm have that. I'm the same the way. Anytime I need coffee, I just go and get a, a cup at a time. Well, I do do it to get out of the apartment. Yeah. I will say, I walk to. Starbucks. Yeah, it's good for that reason, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's a pretty nice day out, actually. It yeah. was raining like crazy, and now it's not raining like crazy. Yeah. Oh, no, thank. You. Is this what sweetener? Yeah, sugar packet. Sugar packet. Thanks. Yeah. Um. Hey guys, want to talk to us? <laughs> no worries. So, you you just completed the the Jeffrey Star series the. The yes. Thing. Yes. I I was trying to think how long ago it was that we posted the final episode. Maybe two weeks ago. Okay. Two and a half weeks ago. Oh my god. Okay. And not not a really strong response, right? No one's watching it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I really. I know you guys worked hard on that, and people don't really care. Yeah. It's it's, it's it sucks. It's yeah. <laughs> it sucks to see like you work so hard on something, yeah. and it only trends like a bunch, you know. Yeah. And you're like, I watched. Why is this only trending like a ton? You know. Yeah. It is crazy. I mean, it, I don't. Uh, it's I, incredibly popular. I do not want this to come off like anything, but it is crazy that we were like, oh wait, so every single video trended number one. It's crazy, yeah. man. It's like, Congratulations. Because sometimes it doesn't. Because sometimes we don't even trend at all right. for whatever reason. Yeah. So that all. Well, of them you were like, you tapped into something that people cared about, and uh, congratulations. Yeah. Well, I appreciate you giving me this moment to reflect on the success of it because yeah yeah, yeah. And, and here we are on the other end yeah in a beautiful uh -huh. day uh-huh beautiful Man. glendale day yeah Neon. i should have brought my makeup palette i bought 20. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's he's yeah. the main reason you sold yeah. out yeah, yeah, yeah. i would 100 percent i bought brought, all of them. brought you one i'm sure there's a way to have got you one <laughs> but they are like I don't know. Yeah. Hard so did find. you did you ever think like a, like two years ago that you'd be this deep into the makeup industry <laughs> selling <laughs> selling palettes and making? Have you ever swatched makeup on your hand? Like, have you ever? I have not. <laughs> she has. Is that what you do? It no. It's like, I 
it is f- cool. Like, oh, yeah? makeup is actually cool. I'm not just saying that because I'm kind of, like, indirectly connected to it. <laughs> guy who it, sells makeup. Makeup's actually cool. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually feminist AF, okay? <laughs> <laughs> well, to answer your question, not at all. Not even for one second. Yeah, um, it's kind of crazy. I think at the end of 2018 is when the wheels started turning that that might be a thing because mm-hmm. we did the first Jeffrey series and yeah, that was yeah. kind of... But, no, yeah, it's it's been the whole year. The whole year. I don't folders of folders of days of filming the process yeah. and how many yeah. hours total do you think you've filmed i should have brought my i should have brought my laptop <laughs> uh, i've been saying in my head like oh we probably have like a hundred hours which probably isn't crazy and it might be more than that honestly right. i know that there was like 40 days of filming like 40 separate days that we filmed wow. like the and bible 40 days and 40 nights yeah <laughs> but what we but probably more than 100 okay which is you know well wow. usually we have like six hours of footage or something I'm trying to think of other things that we've done like the tanagon thing i think that was like i don't know definitely not even more than five hours of footage <laughs> so it was an adjustment period wow for sure so for people who aren't familiar andrew and shane made a docu-series right is that that's how you describe it like a docu-series yeah i think that's yeah um and you've done a bunch of them you did it with tanacon and Jake Paul, Jake Paul, and all the all the titans of <laughs> yeah. the titans of YouTube. Now they're married. You've explored them. Who? Oh yeah, Jake Paul and Tana. <laughs> oh, those two got married. Uh. To find married, and then we'll right. <laughs> answer the question. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> um, yeah, and their their each video they upload gets viewed way more times than any regular documentary, any like in you know main industry. Yeah. Thing. The whole thing has shifted. You guys changed the game. <laughs> well, that's a little too much. <laughs> I think that's a little too much credit in this direction, but I appreciate it nonetheless. But it would be interesting. I don't really know the numbers for other stuff. Like, I don't know. I thought it would make me feel good or bad because then you wonder, like, are people not caught up to it? Because right. you'll sit in a room with some people and they'll not really understand mm-hmm. that you're getting the viewership you're getting. And then it's you're kind of like, am I supposed to? Mm-hmm. Be mad now that right. like, we're, this doesn't make sense. Like you're right. acting like we're not getting these views, but we are. Mm-hmm. So there's a really interesting disconnect between the entertainment industry and YouTube. Because mm-hmm. I primarily work in the entertainment industry. Like I'll write for TV shows, and right. a lot of my friends are all in that world. And yeah. then I'm now getting more involved in the YouTube world just because of Cole and the thing yeah. that we do, and you know all his friends and stuff. And yeah, it's like people who are on YouTube are more popular than people on TV. But there's mm-hmm. like. It's just a, there's well, a weird for, disconnect. for the new generation. For the new generation. I mean, it's like a new, yeah, it's a new thing, but it's just interesting of like trying to figure out what it all means in the entertainment landscape and where people are getting their media. And I don't know. Yeah, I think for sure, obviously, I was talking with somebody about this the other day. Also, I think I have a cold, which is why I'm realizing my voice might sound a little nasally. What do you think? Hmm. Nasally? Well, just, I don't want to catch it through my. Headphones. Yeah, he's worried of getting sick because, yeah, he's he doesn't understand oh, a actually, lot of things. Actually, this is. <laughs> oh, yeah, we switch, <laughs> switch him. Yeah. Switch him. Yeah. Well, yeah. Um, but I was talking with somebody about this the other day, and I was, was saying I think it has a lot to do with the fact that <laughs> I hate when I start talking about stuff like it makes it sound like I think I have any sort of perspective that you do. Valuable. You're, you're, you're yeah. making videos. You're the, the like, well, guy that you, makes them. You could be the judge of it when I really start like going in this direction. <laughs> but like, I think that Jews are bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> I, I uh, like. <laughs> I think that there are obviously like companies and industries and protocols that have been set up that have been kind of the standard for years with things sure so i definitely think like anything else it's going to take a while for people to get in a situation where not so much they can accept it but to where it makes sense for people to accept it for what it is Mm -hmm. i think at this Mm -hmm. point i'm sure there's validity to people not really understanding it because yeah there's so many other things in place and there's so many other ways that business is being done so I'm not going to fault those people for thinking that it's not as valuable for this person to get this many views when a TV show gets whatever. Right. I think in five years, I think it'll be different because even with stream, like even just the way streaming is now, like sure. that alone is a great testament to people kind of sure. getting it because right. nobody wants to. Is iTunes even? A th- I know iTunes is, but I thought I heard that they were getting rid of the possibility to even download and pay for music, I, individual really? song. I don't. I could be the case. Is, uh. I don't even. I think iTunes went away too. It's called like Apple Music now. Okay. Yeah. I don't think iTunes even exists. I didn't know if iTunes uh, was like 
Apple Music podcast and then they separated something. them. Okay. It's now Apple Music and then po- Apple Podcasts are separate. Gotcha. gotcha. I think, um, yeah, but it's like it's interesting because TV shows. I mean, the budgets on TV shows are quite insane, right? And yet, I don't think people are watching them. Like, I I know people who personally are making TV shows, and I'm looking at just like the response to the shows on social media and mm-hmm. stuff and I'm kind of like is anyone watching these shows see that's interesting because the fact that you have a foot in that door is more like I have no idea like what like YouTube stuff yeah I kind of understand like analytics and what's going on but I don't have much of a reference for anything mm-hmm. so that would, would be interesting to even know what that looks like All right but I'm assuming like major movie studios and like networks have tried to reach out to you guys at this point right are you I allowed mean, to talk about that? I don't know if I'm. <laughs> I don't know. And then I just like go <laughs> into the most specific stuff. Um, I. I mean, that's definitely been like in the field of vision. Right. But I think, I think collectively, me and Shane kind of don't really know what the value of that would be of course, unless of it was like right. some like, wh- type why of would you? crazy. I know. I think he said this on some podcast. He's like, well, the only benefit of me really doing a Netflix thing is that I'd have protection and I wouldn't be sued. Or something. Oh, right, so right, it's like right. other than that, which I do agree. It's like, oh yeah, that makes sense. You're not, you know, putting yourself out there in every single, you know, capacity. But um, right. yeah, I just don't know. I mean, the viewership. I don't really know what that looks like. I don't yeah. think. I mean, he built his community or his audience on you know YouTube, and that everything's kind of connected in the YouTube mm-hmm. world. I feel like there would be such a huge disconnect taking that anywhere else. Right. I mean, I'm sure like you know his like conspiracy theory stuff. I think that could play on other formats, but it wouldn't have the same like it wouldn't have the moment it would it would have on youtube if right that makes yeah. sense. Huh. and it also it would be more out of his hands that's true well yeah that's a whole nother thing yeah. that's yeah. like yeah I, you don't even have to get there <laughs> to to kind of right. say maybe that doesn't make sense but once you get there it's like yeah, yeah. that would not that would not be a best case scenario All right the entertainment industry definitely likes to take something that's successful and then change it that is like mm-hmm. a classic thing. So yeah. I could oh, see. Every, <laughs> yeah. Every 20, what's the fashion thing? Every 20 years, everything goes back in. Oh, that's right. definitely the case. Not that yeah. it, <laughs> VHS is <laughs> everywhere. Like <laughs> <laughs> Blockbuster, Blockbuster, I guess Blockbuster wishes that that was the case for The yeah. 90s are back. Yeah. They definitely are fashion wise. There's yeah. like a thing in LA where it's like people who are really hot just try to dress in a way that makes them look ugly. <laughs> Have you guys noticed that? That's like a very popular thing in LA. If someone's like really hot, like they're they really are trying to look bad. Like they shave their eyebrows and stuff. No, I just mean their clothes are like very unflattering and bad. Mm. Mm. Well, well, we, who specifically do you have in mind? I know friends who are like models, oh. and then I see the way they dress, and I'm like, what oh, are you're their trying. Names? I'm not gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> Instagram. <handle. laughs> I just think it's a thing. It's like a. If you were really attractive, it's like a, co- a th- cool thing to like make yourself try to look not good. Okay, it, boomer. Look, it's just a <laughs> thing. Okay. <laughs> how how much is this mic gonna be? Like, <laughs> like, anyway, we'll move on. Uh, uh, you yeah. can cackle as much as you I, like. That that's that's yeah. That's a tr- well, like I listen to mu- like you know music heads. Like we know mm-hmm. some people who are really big into music and the stuff that they'll play. You know, it kind of comes with them having to be like, it, it, like you gotta like listen to it for a while, and then you gotta do this thing, and then in three weeks you'll like listen <laughs> to it again. So I feel like it's like that, you know. Yeah. Right. Maybe there's a little more depth to it that sure, sure, from sure. a from a distance you can't necessarily. That could be true. It could be true. <laughs> could be true. Yeah. Um, but I don't know. I'm not. I don't know much about fashion. So hey guys. No. Uh, yeah. Interesting. So you've gotten. I've known you for what three, four years, three years. Well, we knew through Vine. I've been. I, how long have you lived in LA? I think we've lived in LA for like three, three and a half years. Yeah. So I've probably known you for like four and a half years. Okay, yeah. Through Vine, if we're adding that. Uh huh. <laughs> Where are you from before LA? Um, I say the Midwest because I lived in I Kansas. Do you love us? Come sit down, and talk to us. I literally just watched your. Oh, you just watched us? Come yes. have a seat. Our what? I'm Right. Andrew yeah. Sawicki. She knows all of us. Wow. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I love that you have like your ideal like person to watch. Yeah, come, come sit down and put on these. Okay, what? I were visiting from Chicago. Whoa. Whoa. That's where he lives. That's, well, both of us are I from Chicago. I was just about Paul. to say, and I also Oh, you're from Chicago. Chicago. Okay, Wait, what's, what's your name? Huh? You went to DePaul? Yeah. That's where he went. That's where I went. Whoa. Here, oh, hold on. Street. Speak into there. Speak into there. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Didn't we date for a while? <laughs> wait. Sorry. What's your, what's your name? <laughs> I'm Dalila. Dalila, nice to meet you. I'm Andrew Cole. Andrew. Stephanie, Stephanie, nice to meet you. Yeah. Say nice hi, I'm you. Stephanie, and I'm excited to be here. I'm like trembling. None I'm like, what matter. the fuck? Delila, so you're visiting LA, huh? Well, I'm from here. I grew up in LA, but oh. I was born in Chicago. 
Oh. And yeah, I'm visiting my mom because you know, like DePaul has like really big breaks. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah, we live in Glendale. But so you went, oh. you went, you're born in Chicago, then grew up here, then went back to Chicago for mm-hmm. school. Oh, cool. Yeah, hmm. it's fucking cold there. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. I, got, I just got so triggered thinking about that. <laughs> I grew up in Colorado and I hate the cold and I like living here. Yeah. For that okay. reason. I just saw one of your TikToks where you had contacts on. Oh. And I want to know those weren't. That con- t- those weren't. Contacts. Oh, they were real. Those are well. Sometimes my eyes do that. <laughs> I feel that no, because it like disappeared into your eyes. So uh. that makes sense, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> TikTok on the screen. Did what? You put it on the screen. What? Did you put the TikTok on the screen while she was saying? Yeah, that? I did. Oh, it'll be on there. Yeah. He knows. He's the an editor. He knows. He knows. He knows. I was looking at the camera while that. Yeah. 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 Uh, cool. Wait. So you uh, you're on your six week break. Yes. Yeah. I Whoa. just finished my capstone and I like had a nervous breakdown mm. and I got strep throat from it. Well, be careful. He doesn't want to get sick. Yeah. I'm not sick anymore. I know nobody wants to get sick, but are you yeah. specifically yeah. paranoid <laughs> about specifically being sick? He doesn't want to get sick. Well, because yeah. her germs should go into the <laughs> into microphone, the mic. into the I'll cord, transfer it over, yeah. Mind, even our listeners, even mouth. the people listening to this, they might get strep throat. We don't want yeah. that. I mean, honestly, let's yeah. fucking <laughs> spread the plague. Okay. okay. <laughs> go off. Just kidding. <laughs> wow. I'm kidding. So, uh, what are you studying? I'm a history major, so I don't want to make money. Oh, okay. What do you want to do? Um, I'm trying to find a job right now. (laughs) I had an, well, I had like an interview for the Pritzker Museum of Military History. My favorite, by the (laughs) way. That's my favorite museum. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, I love it there. I love all the military history and I love seeing all the wars and it's great. Okay. They asked me like, what do you know about World War II? And I was like, fuck. I was like, um. Well, you should definitely know if you're a history major. (laughs) I'm sorry. That's like the main, that's the main thing. You're like, oh yeah, you're not getting the job. Sorry. (laughs) That is like the main thing that's happened in the world, period. I know, but I... Like when they ask you, it's like you forget yeah. everything oh, that they you for- learned. Oh, okay, I understand. Yeah. So I was like, um, so I like just said some random information that mm. I knew, but it was it was good. What type of history do you, are you particularly interested um, in? Um, Latin American history. So I lived okay. in Mexico last year. Oh. Yeah, and we're Mexican. It's my cousin. Ooh. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. 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 Hey cousin. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I like the <laughs> Shane Dawson <laughs> series. Are you guys it was like relaxing now that it's over. Yes. We were just talking about this. We were just talking about that. Yeah. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I didn't get the palette just because well, I'm I got like 20. Cole got 20. Yeah, he's got <laughs> way too many of them. Yeah. yeah. I sold, yeah. yeah I sold he's them why out. they sold out. Yeah. Yeah. I was, it looked good, but I was like, this is too much money. I literally, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surviving off of two for two from Duncan's like at oh, well. school. Like I can't pay for this palette. But Are I you going to the it. wedding? Enjoy the wedding. Yeah. Congratulations. Enjoy, big yeah. bird. Someone's getting married. Okay. <laughs> <I> swear, <it's laughs> How much thr- information am I not? It's like been a through line for this show. Do you guys like Glendale? Yeah. yeah. We've done an episode here before. It's nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I saw Maddie Ziegler yesterday. <laughs> that dancer. Oh, yeah. Oh. Sia. 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 Yeah. I like, I wanted to say something to her, but I'm like, it's below me because like I'm older. Oh, right. And I feel like I don't want to like bother her, you know? How, where do you see her? I saw her at the Press Juice and I was oh, like, okay. oh, that's, that's Maddie Ziegler, whatever. How old is she? I think she's like 16 okay. and I'm like I'm too old for that yeah. <laughs> I would not want to like intimidate her at not intimidate her I don't want to make her feel uncomfortable mm. yeah. but you know it's like that yeah, yeah. cool well, two more years and you can she'll be <laughs> yeah she'll be she'll older she'll be legal if to you make stay the to same talk to yeah. Yeah. if you keep your I age can the legally same, say something inappropriate to her but <laughs> not now <laughs> exactly. yeah now yeah. it's not okay yeah. yeah don't be a drake were you guys here like <laughs> 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 Were Sorry, you guys I know when he's the your rain hero. Was falling, uh, we, we were here at the end of the rain. We've been here 51 minutes and 20 seconds. We planned accordingly. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, we had umbrellas and then we're like, fuck it. So where do you live, cousin? Chicago. Oh, you live okay. also cousin and cousin yeah, together. Yeah, she's at last. coming out. <laughs> oh, okay. And what do you do? Um, I'm a broker. Oh, okay. for real estate or? In, I'm um, sorry. Industrial real estate. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. It's like Amazon sell buildings. Oh, yeah. you sold Amazon some buildings? <laughs> we leased to them sometimes. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Very cool. All right. So you could like, I don't know, rent a space for a party or something in what one of that? those? You can rent a space in a party <laughs> for one of those? I'm only licensed in Illinois. Oh, okay. Because so. oh, we got some deals out here yeah. where you need brokered, yeah. but I guess. Well, I can get you a referral. Okay. okay. I'll find someone for you. Do you take a finder's fee a little bit? Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Always Very make a cool. sale. Um, <laughs> no. Fuck. So do you live in downtown Chicago? Yeah. <laughs> like doesn't want to where, where in Chicago? No, I actually am curious. Lakeview. Lakeview. I live in Lakeview, like right next to Boys Town and Wrigley. Wait, I live right. O- I used to live right above Trader Todd's. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh my. No, I. You know, Hydrate the gay bar. Yeah. I live right next to it, so it's Whoa. always fun. Oh. My there. friend lived above it, and it was always her floors were always vibrating at nice. night. 
Yeah, I there's like a big poster like outside of our window that says like Square or something like it's like a yeah. dating website. I have one of those posters at my house on my wall. <laughs> oh, she amazing! It's not, it's, not, it's, not it's not about a dating. It's not a dating yet. poster. It's more of like a <laughs> command. <laughs> yeah, you come in and you gotta do yeah. it as yeah. soon as you see the poster. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> you gotta score as soon as you go inside. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, such a weird thing wait. So <laughs> when you when you graduate, where do you plan on living? Um, I'm probably gonna stay in Chicago. Okay. Even though I grew up in LA, I just mm-hmm. I don't like people here. They're just really weird. Oh, what about us yeah. though? We're all here. Yeah. Yeah, but here. you guys aren't. You guys didn't grow up in LA, right? No. no. See, that's the difference. But yeah. LA is full of people who didn't grow up here, though. Yeah, but I don't know. I feel like the people that I've met, like around my age, they're mm-hmm. all just really weird. Mm. Like, there's a lot of expectations. <laughs> I don't have any friends here. That's why that my true? cousin's with me. Yeah. What do you mean expectations? Just um, like how you have to look or mm. what you have to do and mm. things like that. And I don't give a fuck. I'm sorry. If I'm cussing. No, it's okay. It's okay. Um, no, it's okay. I don't want to demonetize you guys, but no, yeah. I think so. <laughs> I, I truly don't. I'm not sure how yeah, that works even. Ass. That <laughs> that is interesting though because I don't really hang around with people who are from LA. Yeah, yeah. But I, so and then also I always think that people in LA are cool. Yeah. So obviously that probably goes hand in hand though. I think because if, if I didn't know people who are, you know, I from think, other yeah. places, yeah. maybe may, maybe. I, I think don't people know. who grew up here are maybe it's a weird place to grow up or something like that. It's weird weird value systems and but also i've met a lot of people who are from here who are cool i mean you're from here you're cool there's probably others like you i hope so well she's I not mean, from here uh, yeah i was, well, like, I was no, born she grew in up chicago here. Oh, but yeah. i do you guys know ventura yeah that's yeah. where i went to high school in ventura oh, yeah. i oh. surf a lot so i go there pretty often oh awesome yeah, yeah i don't i don't know how to surf see i like like cities like i like to mm-hmm. go out i don't like to hike or like do any yeah. of that okay <laughs> I was like, let's go hiking. She's like, mm, let's go to Shake Shack. <laughs> the <laughs> opposite, the anti hiking. Yeah, but I mean, I was like, it's gonna rain today, so I don't yeah. want to hike. But um, I'm yeah. gonna move back yeah, one day, I like think. To Chicago? Uh-huh. Really? Yeah. I love what the Chicago. hell? <laughs> yeah. Why? I just like it better. <laughs> no, it's it's bad. a better city. Everything yeah. is very concentrated. It's, it's you a can convenient. take the train anywhere you want to go. Yeah, out here I had yeah. to get a car. I'll build you a train. <laughs> I had to build a car. <laughs> I'll build a train. I okay. was a priest. Priest walked by. A I want to know his story. Us too. He looked legit. He won't just, talk to he us. He just seemed like the real deal. Yeah. I don't know what that means, but I felt it. Huh. Yeah. But also, um, Chicago. Uh, yeah, I never got Chicago. I'm not. I'm not trying to like hate on Chicago. I just never understood. But you didn't live in the city. No, right? and that's probably why. I think if I was around it more, every time I went to the city, it just seemed very chaotic. Mm. Chicago. Yeah. Like I, I driving feel like this around. Year. Mm. I feel like that in LA because like you if I want to let's say I want to go to like Santa Monica it's going to take me like an hour and a half but in Chicago if I want to go yeah in Chicago like nothing is more than a f- 15 minute Uber ride I away. mean if you're in Chicago it would take you so fucking long to get to Santa Monica we're like <laughs> way closer to Santa Monica here I'm going to Uber all the way there <laughs> I mean it's cra- we're like way closer to Santa Monica here I don't know why you're complaining <laughs> yeah that's true yeah huh. what do you guys like to do for fun um hmm I go out a lot. Oh, really? It's to the gay bar and stuff? No, I go out to, like, my, my roommate, she'll probably watch this. She's crazy. <laughs> Wait, why but in a good cr- way. In a good way. And <laughs> every weekend, we have to go out. We have to drink. We have, like, bottle service. But it's, Whoa. like... Whoa. Really? <laughs> That's so crazy. <laughs> you guys are spending how much money? No, we don't spend any money. <laughs> why not? At all. It's zero dollars, thanks to our promoters. It's but so funny that you're saying all this because this all sounds exactly like the type of stuff that you're saying that people in LA are lame for. <laughs> <laughs> Promoters and bottle service. You're like, I don't care about that kind of Roast stuff. Roast me. <laughs> I mean, that's true. crazy. Yeah. Damn. No, I, I, <laughs> no, but I can actually, I feel like a celebrity in Chicago, but when I'm here, I feel like dirt. So, oh, yeah. so that's why. I got to live my fantasy life over there. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah small fish, small pond or yeah. big fish, small pond type yeah. thing. Just okay. go out a lot. What I do you? I mean, I've been to clubs. I've I, I have I've been to that situation where I've gotten stuff for free. He said he's seen it. Oh, cool! Thanks. And I hated it. Like, what is good about being in a loud club where you can't talk to anyone? Mm. I'm trying to understand genuinely because I don't personally like those spaces. Um, personally, um. I like to go because I like to go with my friends and just dance. And okay. It's it's like if you're with a good group and like a certain song comes on, it's just fun okay. mm-hmm. to like let loose. Also, if you're like on. If you're like drunk, it's nice. Okay. Yeah. Or like something else. I don't know. I'm not gonna mm. disclaim it. Though, sure. It's like you're trying to talk to your friends at the bar, and then you're just ending up screaming at each That's other. That's what I and mean. You're like, I would rather be at home and just like having a few beers and. See, I think to your I think socializing in LA is much more like hanging out at someone's house and just talking, yeah. and I like that more. Yeah. I don't go out. Yeah. I don't go to bars. 
mostly because I'm not allowed, but I choose not Your to Your mom go doesn't to bars. let you? Uh, no, it's like the <laughs> people who own the buildings. So I don't know if you have any, yeah, you have any with connections? that. House arrest? <laughs> any connections? No. 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 I don't have my card then. <laughs> Give out referrals now. All right. Well, do you like yeah. to go out, Andrew? No way. <laughs> don't you answer for <laughs> it? <laughs> I stars well, house. I no, that's true. Yes. Yeah, no, I don't. I mean, yeah. me and Cole went uh, got ice cream the other day. That was pretty ambitious. Oh, yeah, yeah. that was kind Both of us, actually. Uh-huh. <laughs> Your big day out. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, have you guys had Jenny's ice cream yeah. in Chicago? Do it they have that here? Yeah, there's one on in Cleveland. There's one on Hillhurst. Oh, I don't know. Um, yeah. That ice yeah. cream. Yeah. <laughs> just a simple life. <laughs> what do you do <laughs> if, like, there's ever, like, a parade of people that just for, like, minutes of time? Well, there was a whole, well, there was a Patreon episode where it's only people's legs pretty <laughs> much walking <laughs> it by. It was, cr- it's called The Throng. Yeah. <laughs> That's what the episode's called. I mean, it's just so many people. It yeah. was in Vegas. It was only legs. I'm also glad that I figured this out. Velcro. Oh, how we signed yeah. yeah, this. Yeah. signs on with Velcro. I thought it was a nail, maybe. I was like, they probably did do that. Yeah. Uh, right. So what, you're here till after New Year's, I'm assuming? Yeah, I'm going to Mexico City for New Year's. Like every Ooh. year, my whole family from Mexico, we all reunite. It's like 60 or 70 people. And Whoa. then we all go to somewhere in Mexico. So we're going to Mexico City this year, but it's going to be where did you li- Where did you live in Mexico for a year? Um, I lived in Guanajuato. So I went to school there in the UNAM. There's also like a lot of um, political politically things that are going on there right now like Tell students are protesting at the UNAM because what's the UNAM I've never heard um, of that university the Universidad de uh, Mexico or something like that okay mm-hmm. um, what was that was that Chinese, was that Chinese? <laughs> Mandarin oh, okay. oh, cool. oh same she thing she actually speaks Mandarin really? I tried. yeah really? that's my my undergrad minor prove it <laughs> <laughs> Nope, she doesn't. She doesn't. She doesn't. She doesn't. She doesn't. Uh, another World War II <laughs> response <laughs> flashback. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, um, so tell me about these protests and stuff. Um, so students are being murdered currently. Like there's been like 60 students that have been murdered. Sexual oh my gosh. like allegations. And I went to school there, so like. That's crazy. Um. Yeah. So. Wait, being murdered by other students? No, like um, professors and like governmentally like things are occurring in mexico um so students are protesting right now whoa professors are murdering students not murdering them but so there have been students from the unam that have been murdered but there have been sexual allegations from professors against oh, students okay. and uh, that personally happened to one of my friends that oh was my there because it was i went on like um like a program called CIEE, like students from the united states go and live in mexico okay. and she was like um assaulted by one of her professors That's and crazy. she never talked about it and now the allegations are coming out so yeah so is there just a whole culture there like why is it happening at this specific school i mean not at like i mean i guess i guess you could say it, I feel like, it like happens at a lot of schools regardless really it, like people just don't talk about it wow so i know there's a lot of sexual assault in schools in america and i've seen a documentary about it but i didn't know that professors were involved it's i feel like professor relationships in mexico are way more different so he Weird. like it's more like they're your friend. So he asked her and like her other friend to go to like the bar or like something to an apartment. And then she was, she was, she got drunk, of course. And mm. then like he's like, oh, do you want to smoke weed? And she smoked weed. And then it was just. Laced with something? I don't know. <laughs> but she said that like it was just like not like, like things that happen after. Sure. I'm really sorry yeah. to hear that. And yeah. I, I hope yeah, that things uh, yeah. get better. So I hope people know. Like, cause yeah, I yeah. feel like here it's very. Like people don't know what's going on around the world, so that's what I was like. Yeah, no, that's that is true. Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's too much going on. Sorry, that got sad. <laughs> no, 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 it's interesting, that's and that's your on. that's your perspective. Yeah, you no. like open up Twitter, and there's like everything. Like every single day, you see something like negative or something bad happening. It gets like overwhelming because you don't see as many like happy stories. Yeah. It's difficult. Yikes. It's true. It's a difficult yeah. world. Well, oh. well, enjoy to Paul. Thank you. You guys seem like it's good, thank you. good young people, and thank we're you for talking to us. Yeah. Thank you so much. We're gonna give you each a dollar and a sticker. For oh being my God. guests on our show. Thank you. Can we take a picture with you guys? Yeah, of yeah. course. Yeah, you can do that. Thank you. Yeah. I <laughs> when I first sat here, I was like shaking. I was like, Fuck. No, you did a good job. <laughs> that just happens yeah. to me every time I, I see someone that I recognize. Oh yeah. But I feel. Are there a lot of people you recognize in Chicago? Um, well, she's my friend saw Jane Lynch. Oh, oh yeah. That's good. Yeah, it was oh. good. I he, like her. She kind of looks like Andrew, huh? <laughs> Jane Lynch <laughs> from like Glee. Very out of nowhere. I'll oh. take it. Definitive. I'll take it. Okay, let's do these pictures. Let's do this picture. Th- thank you guys for being a guest. You're a great yeah, guest. Yeah, appreciate it. You can just walk by. It's fine. Oh. Yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> you get the camera. Back. It's fine. <laughs> Double cameras. Just walk. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Okay. Thank cool. you. Of course. See you guys. Thanks for being a guest. See you guys. Yeah. Yeah. It was really nice to talk to you guys. Mm-hmm. Nice to talk to you as well. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. See ya. 
Well, they were nice. Yeah. They were very nice. But Andrew, you were such a great guest. Yeah. Well, I hope I did. I did the show and the format and the everything justice because you did, you did mm-hmm. it all. What an impossible feat to do! But of I, course, I, I, you did everything justice. You, you say so. I'll you talked about it. some interesting stuff. You yeah. were fun and lively, and everything went well. Yeah. well this we'll, is great. We'll it send you your. Tr- what do you say your appearance fee was? Like a hundred k. My appearance fee. Well, I mean, I, I the mean, coffee. The dollar is. You do get the dollar. Yeah, that is yeah. the fee. But, but yeah, yeah, I mean, dude, I know, publicly. I always tell you, but this is like the best. This is like the best thing. Oh, that's nice of you to say. It really is. It's so fun to watch. I don't really. I'm not really like. I don't really get into podcasts and stuff, yeah. but anytime you guys post Thank you, it, Andrew. Oh, thank you. You it. said you and Matt watched a few episodes the other day. Oh, yeah. Day. We were just Matt Real sat in this exact seat in this exact location yeah, yeah, he uh, did. the I, last I time I we heard. were here. I yeah. heard. It's coming out soon. Sick. Well, Andrew, thank you so much for being a guest. If you're one of the, if you're not one of the hundred million people who've watched all his videos, <laughs> go watch them and add one to that tally. Um, mm-hmm. Thank you so much for being a guest, well, Andrew. It was a pleasure. It. Yeah, yeah. All right. See thank you, guys. Andrew. Thanks for watching. Bye. Have a great life. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. The Podcast But Outside live show is coming up. It's on Monday. We've got follow-up interviews, surprise guests. It's going to be a great night. Let's announce a guest now. Okay. Chris Fleming. Hey, Chris. Hey, Chris. Hey, Andrew. Can I have a quick word with my guy Cole here? No problem. Are you still cool to count on you for 600 a month? Oh, for the group of the... For Pusis? You came briefly, remember? You enjoyed your time? They sliced my hand pretty good. That was back when Tenancy was running things. Now it's Wes. He's a gorgeous, different leader. And if you stop trying to get (laughs) Cole to join your cult, he is susceptible. Oh, Andrew, it's not a cult. Again, this is a Sacramento-based group of incredibly sexy, independent thinkers. So, Cole, for $600 a month, you get limited access to the Sacramento Lodge. Ooh. That's a nice A-frame right off the exit. What is limited access? Of the Route 5. Don't worry. It's a... For Community Feast, you get to watch it. I'm telling you, Cole, this is a really good deal. It's just through PayPal. Mm-hmm. Only PayPal. I'm free besides the show if you want more people in the Unfortunately, we're full, Andrew. Thank you. Okay. Well, 8 p.m. on Monday, January 20th at Dynasty Typewriter Theater. We'll see you soon. Yeah. <laughs> what a fun episode. Thank you. It was really great. You s- this is how we end every episode. Close. I think it's exactly word for word, maybe. Is that okay? I like oh. consistency. Well, yeah, I guess. But Here's yeah. a word that's never been said. Shl- slurb. I've definitely heard that before. Slurb. Yes. And slurb to you as well, yeah. folks. Thanks for watching. Buy tickets to our live show. Or buy tickets to any live show. Neil Young is on tour. Um, Tupac is back. As a hologram. As a hologram. And also um, Airbud from the movie Airbud is doing... Uh, Stadiums. We should die so that we should have, so we can do a hologram show. We should die and we will die. Oh. As is right with the universe. Shalom. Shalom. I've got a podcast.